Hey, assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's been a while. Today's video is quite random actually. I bought some facial uh, hair bleach today because I wanted to bleach some facial hair and also a little bit of my eyebrows. And last time I did that a few months ago, I did post a picture on my Instagram stories and you guys went nuts. You guys wanted to see how I like how I groom my eyebrows since I don't pluck them or I don't pluck like the um, my actual eyebrow I do pluck like the stray hairs that are up here if you can see up here and also uh, in between my eyebrows uh, but yeah so I thought why not just uh, film it for you guys so you can actually see how I do it's very simple uh, but it could be nice to actually show you uh, how how I do it so to remove my eyebrow makeup, I'm just going to use some micellar water. Uh, this one is from H&M. It works really good actually and it's very cheap. Okay, so these are my brows, my natural eyebrows. And like I said before, I do pluck them here in between uh, since that is not considered a part of the eyebrow. Also, if I have some hairs up here, like on my forehead, I do pluck those. Uh, but other than that, I keep them quite natural. They're quite bushy and full, uh, but I do bleach them to sometimes when I get want to get like a, a little bit more cleaner look, I guess you can say. Back in the days, like when I was a teenager, I used to pluck my eyebrows like crazy. Like I used to have those super thin waxed eyebrows. So when I went from that to stop plucking my eyebrows, when I had like my transition phase, I used to bleach like everything that I used to pluck before like here, you know, when I shaped my actual eyebrow, I used to actually bleach that and that was not a cute look and that's not what I'm gonna show you guys today. So I'm gonna show you guys how I I groom them naturally, like they're still gonna look quite bushy, uh, but they're gonna look a little bit more neat. Uh, so like the hairs that are like all the way down here, you know, and also like here and also like here here that's what i bleach and also for today i'm gonna bleach my actual eyebrow because i want to tint them uh, so they're that they're just a tiny bit lighter uh, so yeah that's what we're gonna do let's start mixing the actual bleach okay so this is what you're gonna need uh, this is what the actual bleach that was in the package and then you get also like a spatula and a mixing bowl but i don't like that it's a, quite a small bowl so i just use my own from Morocco, I love this one. And I use some cotton buds. Are these called cotton buds? Not sure. And uh, my phone, because you don't want to keep the bleach on for too long. Uh, this is what I used earlier too. Or actually this, you will need this to get off, get the actual bleach off your eyebrow. I'm gonna mix two parts of the gentle cream bleach and then one part gentle cream activator. I'm gonna show you guys how that looks like. Okay, I use around that much. Oh, actually that was quite a lot. And then I'm trying to do this with one hand here. And then I use half the amount yeah, of the activator. And then I just get my spatula and I mix it. I'm just gonna use one of these to put on the bleach on my eyebrows. Uh, you can use a brush uh, to get like extra position, uh, but I've been doing this for a lot of years now, so I'm, I'm good with these. So as you can see, I don't go all the way in uh, like I would do a couple of years ago. Uh, so I keep a little bit of the bushy part. And then this part I do bleach, like I don't have that many hairs here, but a few and those ones I, I want to bleach. Uh, so I put some bleach on top of those. And then also if I have some hairs here, like I do, I just put some bleach there. And then I just move on to the rest of the brow. I basically just go around the brow uh, so anything that's there is gonna get bleached i don't really touch the actual shape of my brow and then i think this one also makes a difference when you put bleach under here 
it looks a little bit cleaner. Also make sure that you coat all the hairs, so don't just put it on top, like make sure that all the hairs get coated with the, with the bleach. That's a lovely look, isn't it? Oh my gosh, this should be my thumbnail. Oh, and I forgot to say, before doing this, make a patch or a test to see if you're allergic to this or not. Because uh, some people are very sensitive to uh, cream bleaches. So you want to test it on a safe spot first uh, before doing this. But this bleach, you want to leave it on for 10 minutes because otherwise you're going to burn your skin. So it's very important, guys. 10 minutes is up. Let's remove this and check how it looks like. I'm actually going to use this spatula to like scrape off everything. And then I'm just going to take the excess off like this. All right, let's take a look. How is this looking? It did bleach. Like, I don't know if you can see, but it looks a little bit cleaner. Wait, I have still have some left. I think I'm going to go with the second round here. And uh, I might as well just do that since I'm already going to put some bleach on my eyebrows right now. Um, but if you're, if you have sensitive skin, I would not advise you to do it twice like I do. Uh, but I've done it before and it works for me. Okay, I'm just going to remove this and then do the actual eyebrow. Okay, so now I'm going to coat my eyebrows. So I've got the bleach here and I'm just gonna go in. I'm doing a little uh, swirling motion so just to make sure that everything gets coated. So you gotta be quite fast when doing this because uh, you don't want to leave the uh, bleach on for too long. Trust me, I did that once and I got a shock when I removed the bleach from my eyebrows. I was left with blonde eyebrows. And I know that's like a trendy look uh, for people who have like dark eyebrows, but they bleach them blonde. But, or for models that look very, very cool. But on me, it did not look very cute. Okay, so I'm gonna put the timer on four minutes and then we're gonna remove this and see how it looks like. Okay, so I'm just gonna remove the uh, bleach. I think it's the right shade now. All right, you guys. Uh, it looks like my skin is a bit irritated uh, since it's all red around the eyebrows, but I promise it's not that bad. It's gonna fade away uh, pretty soon. I'm gonna move on to this eyebrow now and bleach that. Uh, but I think I'm gonna check back with you guys tomorrow to show you the final result, how it looks like, and also how it looks like when it's filled in. Cause I personally, personally think it looks a little bit better when I fill uh, the eyebrows in and uh, when I have them a little bit lighter. So I'll see you guys tomorrow for the final result. Hey you guys, it's the next day and this is the result of the eyebrows. Um, I'm, I'm quite happy with the, how we turned out. Uh, at first I thought they were a little bit too light, but I think it's just like I had to like get used to it. And now they're kind of growing on me. I kind of like them. I'm currently not wearing any makeup on my eyebrows just to show you guys how the uh, color turned out. Uh, but I am gonna fill them in uh, so you can see how the final result will look like. So the bleaching part is just like the grooming part and now I'm gonna fill them in. So let me zoom you guys in.
so that's pretty much how I fill my brows in very quickly. Nothing advanced. I use this um, very cheap uh, brow product I found in the store because um, I had to get something that matches this my new eyebrow color. <laughs> I'm not sure what this brand is called, but whatever. Uh, it looks like this. Looks like that. Oh wait, I need to do the YouTube thing. Looks like that. <laughs> and then I just used some uh, concealer underneath to uh, kind of tidy up. Uh, this is also a tip uh, for you bushy brow ladies out there. If you want to get that cleaner look use a concealer underneath sometimes i do use it oh like on the top here um mostly for like when i do occasional uh makeup for like parties and stuff like that and then lastly i just use my nyx uh, control freak brow gel and that's pretty much it that's how i groom and fill in my eyebrows i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it was helpful and i will see you guys in my next one inshallah take care bye bye